it all started with the 54 UEFA member states all entering the qualifiers. Now the 24 that made it this far are set for the race to be champions of Europe. Opening page of this season's story. We can only guess what the scriptwriters have in store. Players stand shoulder to shoulder in singing the national anthems. for the game. Away. Jim, who do you pick out as the telling individual today? I'm going to go for the experienced Igor Akinfeyev. Now, he's always been an agile stopper, but having been on the scene from, from such a young age, he's a much calmer decision-maker these days. Yes, getting the best out of him will count for so much. Klein. Denisov did well to emerge with the ball. That's a contest to keep an eye on. Ball's loose. Who's getting there? Kane. Rooney. He's off on a marauding run. He scored! Well, if that was their intention pre-match, let me tell you, it's worked out very nicely. I think for the skipper to chip in with a goal, too, is a bonus. But this game has already taken on a real attacking edge, and, and long may that continue. Well, no goalkeeper would keep that out. It really was a bullet. Oh, the contact was fantastic. Right on the bootlaces, and it packed a lot of venom for what was a really potent strike. That has certainly made things interesting. Denisov tries to get it forward quickly. Oh, too much weight on that. Rooney. Lalana. And it's Rose. Tries a through ball. Lalana. Lalana. Decides to play it back. England making the ideal start. It is something to build on. Well, they've managed to get their noses in front early because they've been much quicker out of the stalls. They've set a high tempo and intensity and look as though they, they want it much more at the moment. Done. Lalana has come through and he's had a quick look inside. Jagoev Where to from here? Hit long and direct. And that'll go straight through to the keeper. Lalana. K. 
Kane. Rose, with the ball through. It's Rooney! It's anyone's ball. That'll be a throw. Fine defending there. Rooney. Klein. That's one way of trying to make things happen. There's a few who could follow that example. Who's going to make this theirs? And the whistle goes for half-time. Well, you obviously have to give credit to the front men for the half-time lead, but I think the midfield can really pat themselves on the back too. They work tirelessly for me. England go in at half-time with a slender one-goal lead. Here we go again. England carry a one-goal lead into the second half. Denisov comes long and forward. Another piece of really good defending. Kane. Klein. Not much subtlety, he's launched himself there. Loose ball, who's going to get there? Looks to slip it through. Chance! He scores! Two to the good! They have breathing space! Really outwitted one-on-one. -on -one. Once more, he gets the better of the keeper. I just thought he was alert and direct. There was no messing about. He was too quick for the keeper, and that's a fine finish. England get themselves a two-goal cushion. Well, that second goal has given them so much more command and confidence now, and they should be able to take it on from here and either add to their lead or, or close it out. Surely they'll manage one or the other. Good work on the right flank. Now, what's next? England have kept themselves very lucky there. They look fragile. Kane. England still contemplating when to use their last remaining substitute. Klein tries a long pass towards the front. Looking to shoot! They are rampant! Surely now, beyond all doubt. He was urged to shoot, and he duly delivered. Yeah, I've got great admiration for the finish, but I've even more admiration for the pass that set it up. It was delicious. England take a three-goal lead, and they are romping out of sight. And it's Cochrane. And he's through on goal. No, oh, he's missed it. Yeah, with him being under pressure from a couple of opponents, I thought he showed real determination to get some sort of attempted goal, and we have to give him credit at least for that. It's a fabulous position. Well, once the keeper lost control of that, it could have gone either way, but it was a good reaction from the defender. 75 minutes played.
Klein. Passes it through. Sterling. Wilshire. Rose. Sterling. Rose. Rooney. Rose. Now it's Kane. Chance to shoot. Dinks one in. We sit high. It's the goalkeepers to play. And it's Kane. Confirmation that there will be two minutes stoppage time. Wilshire cuts it out. Aim forward. Rose. Thrust towards the front line. Klein. And time is up. England were irresistible here. Dominant, utterly ruthless. Only ever one result. A comfortable win. Well, what are your thoughts on today's game then, Jim? I think it's all about setting the right tone at the start of a match and if you can back that up with an early goal it just energizes everybody the whole performance and i think they were certainly more fluid as a result of the early goal many thanks to jim and with that it is a very good night to you